State's Formation, uh, here with Katie Golomsky, senior guard on the women's basketball team out of Milwaukee, uh, Wisconsin. Uh, Katie, appreciate sitting down for a, a few minutes here. How's life? Tired. Tired? Yeah, we had 6 a.m. this morning, so yeah. it's been a long day. But like you said, now you're done for the day. Yeah, so, so that's nice. You can maybe take a little afternoon nap and mm -hmm. get all ready for St. Mary's tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So, um, How was uh, Thanksgiving, first off? It was great. Um... He uh, changed practice early, so right. I got to. Some of us got to go home right. for the first time in a while. Yeah. So it was really nice to get home and surprise the family. Yeah, so. very cool. So it was a surprise. You didn't. Tell yeah, no, I didn't tell my mom or my dad, oh. and they were completely surprised. So. Yeah, very cool. Very cool. Well, let's talk about your senior year. Um, you guys have a lot of, you know, young players this year, but um, in turn, uh, you four yeah. seniors have, have been together for four years. Um, mm -hmm. Let's talk about that, the, the combination of having that experience with you and Janae and Jesse and Vanessa, both all of those new kids and you know your role on the team. Um, well, it's great that us four could be together all four years and finish out strong, all of us healthy, right. all of us grade-wise are really good and really strong in the academics. And we just have to be the leaders that we were learned, like trained to be right. when we were younger it's for, for all these new kids and all four freshmen and a couple juco kids and all the sophomores just to keep it going when we leave sure. and just be leaders then when we leave so. right definitely um you know obviously you're a little more than two months in you know when, when you guys started practice right at the start of october so right about two uh, over two months mm -hmm. um talk about the transition you know, for the last two months, getting all of those kids, you feel like you guys are starting to finally gel right before, mm -hmm. you know, Christmas here, and then when you come back, you're going to be right into conference play, yeah. which really matters. So where do you feel like the team's standing right now? Um, we're all finally starting to get on the same page. Right. Um, mm -hmm. It's just hard. It's not hard learning all the new plays, but right. getting them to play faster sure. is different from high school and college. Right. Um, especially with the freshmen, and everyone's just starting to get it, and we're all starting to become a little bit closer every day, sure. every time that we practice. So it's definitely getting there. Definitely. Um, start of the year, you broke a significant record, mm -hmm. a three-point career record. Um, talk about what that means for you personally to ha to have that record um, and know that you're at the top of that list. Um, I. <laughs> I know you don't play for I'm records. Really I, I know sure. you're the person. I know you're not like oh, I'm. I'm really excited. I got that record. But I'm sure a part of you is like just really proud of that accomplishment. Yeah, to know it's that. it was big. It was just a shock. Like I didn't even know I was even yeah, close. close. Right. I didn't even know it existed. Mm -hmm. I didn't know how many. I didn't even think about it until it right. happened. And sure. when it happened, it felt great, and it's a good feeling now. Just just to keep playing, just to stay on track is right. really what I'm focused about, and just finishing out the senior year strong. Sure, definitely. Um, just one game this week, so a nice little light week for you guys. Mm -hmm. um, uh, talk about St. Mary. What what do you guys know about them? What What's the game plan, I guess, for the Statesman tomorrow night? Uh, to shut down number 44. Okay. <laughs> She's a big Division One transfer. She's really good. Right. With, that's been our main focus all week is her and a couple other shooters. Sure. They're number eight in the country. They're eight and one right now, so... It should be a good game tomorrow. Good, good little battle, huh? Yep. Definitely. And staying focused is what we needed all week. Sure, sure. Um, you excited or anxious, I guess. Not excited. You're not going to be excited about finals, but anxious about finals. Feel pretty confident you're going in. Yeah. Um, as a senior, I've set up my schedule pretty easily. Right. And some of them aren't even finals, so sure. I'm there just ready to get them over with yeah. and <laughs> move on to one more semester of college. There you go. Well, we'll talk about that in a second. Um, we talked about basketball. I like switching gears now. Talk about um, a little bit more about Katie Golomsky, see how you tick and, and all of that. So you've watched some videos. You know what's yeah. coming here. <laughs> yeah, I do. This is not a big surprise. So um, start right off. Nickname. Uh, well, uh, Coach Brown calls me Kate, and so I guess that went on. And then the team calls me Kathy. Uh, or Kath, or Grandma <laughs> Kath. So, sure. along those lines of the names I don't like. Right, right. So we'll just go with Katie then. Okay. okay. All right. Uh, why'd you choose William Penn? Basketball. 
Sure. I had never heard of this place right. <laughs> before <laughs> Coach Brown and Coach Bielbauer, when he was the head coach, they found me, and so I just right. took it and sure. came. And rolled with it. Yeah. Four years later. Pretty much. Uh, if you could describe Coach Brown in one word, what would it be? Uh, Keeping a PG. I know. <laughs> we'll just go with intense. Yeah, that's exactly the word I was thinking. Yeah. Intense. Uh, people say you look like. Can be a famous person, can be just a family member. My dad. Okay. <laughs> you can see that. Without that, go to you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, favorite movie? Tangled. Cool. Favorite TV show? Law and Order SVU. Ah, man. You knew that one right yeah, away. Yeah, that was good. Um, what's your goal in this sport? Just to be the best that I can be. Right. Just finish it out strong. Uh, team goal? Get the conference. Get a ring. Get the nationals. All yeah, that get to stuff. nationals. Sure. Um, if you had a million dollars, what would you buy? Mm. Whatever my parents wanted or needed. <laughs> Take care of mom pay, and dad first. Pay them right? all back for everything they've done. There you go. Uh, currently listening to in your iPod or uh, in your car? Uh, the radio. No, not really not, a song. Nothing, nothing in particular. Nothing fancy. There you go. No. A little bit of everything. Okay. Yeah. Uh, favorite food? Everything. Everything. A lot of yum yums. What was your favorite food at uh, Thanksgiving? Big stuffing person. Oh yeah. 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 I agree. Stuffing's yeah. awesome. Uh, favorite sports hero. Mm. Okay. I sent you guys. I don't really have one. Right. Have no. Favorite sports team. I don't really have one. Equally, oh man. I don't. Okay. The William Penn Lady States. There you I go. <laughs> I, I like that answer the best. Uh, if you were a superhero, who would you be? Um. Superman. Superman. I like that. Uh, and finally, tough one, we talked about it before, so I think you're ready for it. Person in history you would most like to meet and why? <laughs> um, do they have to be famous? They can be anybody. Oh. oh gosh. Can be alive, can be dead. I have no idea. Oh, you weren't prepared. You no, were just I making fun prepared. of Vanessa for her <laughs> answer, so. She um, called you out, Vanessa, and uh, she didn't have an sorry. answer either, so. We'll come back to that. I'm going I'm to hit you on that one more time. Okay. Uh, I do have another question. Um, if you were talking to a recruit, trying to sell them on William Penn, tell me what you'd say. What would, what would you tell a recruit? Um, it's a small community, community-based campus. Mm -hmm. um, everybody knows everybody. You can be friends with them if you want. If you don't, that's fine. But I like how it's community-based. Everyone gets along with everyone. The team, we all, like, even JV and varsity, we're all a program. It's not right. just two teams together. Sure. So we're all friends. We all hang out. Like, right. Just come and enjoy it. Enjoy yourself. Don't look at the town. Look at William Penn University. It's right. The town is small, but there's plenty to do on campus. Sure. Lots and of events offered. And if you're in sports, you're staying, like, staying plenty busy yeah, during the year. Exactly. Anyhow, you'll, so. you'll be busy enough to right. where you'll practice, go to class, and then probably go to bed. Right. <laughs> and this comes from somebody that came from Milwaukee. So we're talking right, a big city, big city <laughs> versus coming to a small, small town. town. Yeah. So great. All right. I'm going to hit you up again. Gosh. Person in history. Um, I, I'd want to like go meet my family members sure. that aren't and, around anymore. Yeah. And that was so another one. That was another option I was going to throw out. All of so, them. Yeah, maybe an ancestor. Sure. Gotcha. Well, Katie, appreciate uh, sitting down for a few no minutes. Problem. It was fun getting to, to know you a little better on this side of things. So yeah. um, best of luck tomorrow night, 530, College St. Mary coming to town. Yeah. So big win. Let's go get one. Yep. All right. Thanks, Thank Katie. you.